Facebook can be a powerful tool to help small businesses grow, but when two small business owners got locked out of their Facebook business profiles, they alerted the I team to get help and warn others. I couldn't talk to my customers. Alan Meta's Facebook was recently hacked, freezing him out of his personal profile and preventing him from using his business page. Alan's one-stop computer repairs based out of Brookfield. People weren't seeing my business when they were looking for me on Facebook. Naperville resident Romello Barnes experienced similar frustrations when a hacker gained access to a business page he uses for acting and comedy gigs. The hacker posing as Barnes solicited money from the page's 5,000 followers. He's making people think that I'm stealing money. It literally had put a damper on my life, social media, to the point where I was panicking like, this dude is killing my career. Barnes says Facebook didn't help, so he did something security experts do not advise. He paid a ransom to the hackers, a hefty price on top of the cost the hack had on his reputation. When I tell you he was doing damage, it was so many people talking to me, quote unquote, and I'm like, wow. Meta also says he didn't get assistance from Facebook's help page, and Facebook doesn't have a live customer service phone number. It was just, just a dead end. After the I-team reached out to Facebook, Meta was able to get back into his account. But because it was hacked, he says he still cannot purchase Facebook advertising for his business. Facebook says it recommends regular checks and updates to your accounts. Also, you should perform a security checkup to activate alerts in case someone tries to log into your account from an unrecognized device. Also, enable two-factor authentication. Meta says he did receive emails from Facebook notifying him that his password was changed, but it was too late. He says he believes he did have two-factor authentication enabled, so he's baffled about his hack. What in the world kind of person would do something like this? Facebook also has a feature where you can view where you're logged in and check for any unauthorized device logins for your account. Links and more tips on our website, abc7chicago.com. Jason Knowles, ABC7 Eyewitness News.